back to 26 Acres Outdoors. We are back in the kitchen once again. We are going to make something new and different that we've never made before and little Fauna here is going to help me to speed the process up. I've got everything all diced up and ready to go. We are going to make apple cider venison stew. It's very different. I've never made it or heard of it, but I did get it out of this awesome cookbook, uh, the Complete Venison uh, Cookbook by Harold Webster. It was a gift a few Christmases ago from one of the kids. Awesome, awesome gift. I uh, actually do a lot of different recipes from there and kind of either combine a few or make my own or take one and run with it. So we're going to kind of stick to the recipe on this one because it's new. And uh, let's show you what we got. We've got some, what we got? Carrots and celery, which Fauna has been eating nonstop. We've got a pound of our venison for, for stew. We've got a large potato and some sliced onions, some thyme, some apple cider, oh, sorry, rather, apple cider, and some apple cider vinegar. First step is we take a little flour, salt, and pepper. We're going to put our venison in there. We've already got prepped up. Oh, look at that. And we're just going to kind of mix it up, coat it with that uh, mixture. And then we already have our Dutch oven heating on the stove. And we're going to, next step, we're going to brown this up real nice after we got it coated. But you keep eating those? Is there going to be any left for our stew? I don't know. So there we go. You got the idea of that? Now let's get, uh, let's get it browning. All right, we got her nice and hot. Might be a little too hot. We'll put our venison in there. There's a little oil in the pan. And we're just going to brown that real quick. Let's see if you guys can see. We're going to brown that real quick. So that's all nice and browned up. And now for all, you're gonna take next step, a half a cup of water in the pot, not on the stove. Hold on, let me get a little bit extra. You gotta try to get it in the pot, sweetie. Next, we need a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. So you hold this over this. Hold it, don't touch the pot. Hold it right there. Ready? I'm gonna pour it in. Or I'm gonna pour a spoon. So we got one tablespoon apple cider vinegar. Dump that in. There we go. Yeah, nice. I got water in my Yeah, that's water. Then we are going to do a half a tablespoon teaspoon. I can find it. Half a teaspoon of the ground thyme. Okay. Here, go in there and get us a scoop. Yeah. I got a good scoop. Put that in. Shake it in. Okay. Yeah. Next, it smells like Easter with that vinegar. Okay. Yeah. Now we just got regular apple cider vinegar. I mean, ugh. now we just got <laughs> regular apple cider that we've been drinking in the house. So, Fawn, you're going to hold this cup over the thing. Put those down. Got it? So we're going to use one cup the apple of apple cider. That's good. Okay, dump it in. And we're going to dump that in. Ow! Okay, watch out. It smells good, huh? Yep. Alright, and then now we're just going to stir that all up. We're going to... We are going to cover this, bring it to a boil, and uh, then we'll go to the next step. Stop eating all of us, our ingredients. <laughs> Silly. All right, it's boiling uh, rather nicely, so now we're going to reduce the heat down to a simmer. Cover it. it. Says for two hours or till the meat's tender. I don't think it's going to take two hours, and then we'll uh, add in our veggies and go from there. 
So let me turn this down. All right, while we wait, what we figured would uh, complement uh, some stew pretty good is some uh, good old corn corn muffins. So we're gonna, Flo and I are gonna make those just to I step out of the box. Ones. Yeah, we're gonna do those ones. Here, you pour that in. <laughs> pour that in the, in the, there. Get it all in there. Does that come out? That's the Does it come out? No, it's stuck in the bottom. I'm done. You do it. Oh, there we go. All out. Okay. Yeah. So, then we're just gonna, here, hold on. I gotta mix it, put the, water, the milk in. A little bit of milk and an egg that I just butchered. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. What egg tail? Yeah, I got the shell in there. What egg tail? What egg tail? Here, use this. Mix it up. Okay, you mix that up. And we're going to make a request of a little fawn. She wants some snowman muffins. And to keep with the outdoor theme, we're going to use some make some fish corn muffins. So mix that up. Where'd you put the fork? Oh. All right, we're gonna mix this up. Lola, our stew's still cooking. Is it good? Is it almost done? Mama, mama, I'm jumping. Is it good? Oh, I'm trying to think. Alright. Mm. I'm ready. Alright, been simmering for almost two hours. So now we're going to add our vegetables. You ready? Yeah. Come on, give me a hand. Are you helping me or not? Yeah. So we got our uh, onions and our potatoes. And what else are you adding in? Mm. What are those? Carrots yeah. and cherries. Okay, well you're not even in the film because, there you go. What are we adding? Carrot and hummus. Okay, not hummus, carrots and... Celery. Celery. Right, mix that up. I make it like that. You want to mix it? Yes, yeah. I like it. I like it. You want to mix it? Okay, mix it. Careful, the pot's hot. Okay. All right. Now we're gonna bring that up to a boil, and then once it hits the boil, we're gonna cut it down to a simmer in uh, about 45 minutes till everything tenderizes up. What do you think? Smells good? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Just finished up. Looks pretty good. Nice and thick. The only thing I did do was I doubled the liquids. So instead of putting a oh, half cup of water, put two cups of water. Instead of putting a cup of apple cider, I put two. Because once I put it all in, and I put in all the, everything else, there wasn't really much broth. So I stuck with the same amount of meat and then uh, veggies and stuff. So let's give it a try. Okay, a little helper went to bed. Fun, I was past your bedtime. So me and mommy are going to give it a taste. You ready? You dripping? I'm dripping. <laughs> Making a mess. It's good. It's sweet. Not like you thought it was. You're like no. it the whole time. Ew, it smells gross. It smells yeah, it didn't gross. smell so hot when I was cooking it. It's not bad. I prefer the one with mushroom flavored, but nobody likes no, the other house. No, the other one has a little tomato in it too. And tomato. But this isn't bad if you like apples. Uh, it's just a sweeter version of uh, venison stew. It's not that yeah, sweet. it's got a little sweet. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Tastes it. It was good. It's worth a shot. Is it my favorite? No. I will say that, but I will eat it, and it is good. Worth a try. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Catch you next time.